Hey, Cardo, music on. So in this episode, we're gonna focus on the Cardo Pack Talk Edge. Um, we're gonna talk about the grouping features and we're gonna also talk about the recording features um, directly to the phone and to the X4 here. Um, that's a new feature for the Cardo and the X4. Uh, you're supposed to be able to, to vlog, so we're gonna test that out and see if you can actually record grouping as well. And um, yeah, I gotta go meet up with my buddy Haman and uh, we'll do some tests. So it says it's 11 degrees, so not exactly a warm day. Luckily I'm wearing some uh, merino wool by a company called uh, Foreign Rider. And uh, that's a new set for me. Uh, so I'll be testing that out. And we'll see if, uh, if I can stay warm today. Alright, so met up with Hammond, we've had uh, our coffee, and now we're gonna go somewhere a little bit more quiet so we can uh, film the setup and see how easy this Cardo stuff is to, uh, to group. Actually, while we're heading up to find a spot to do some uh, group pairing, I'm gonna try and uh, do some solo recording here to see how that works. There we go, so let's record. I actually like how easy this is to, to set up and start recording. There we go. So now I'm recording voice. I got a Rode uh, Wireless Pro in the helmet, as well as um, the Cardo. So this is what the Rode sounds like doing 80. And this is what the Cardo sounds like. So this is the road when you're mixing it with the um, with the engine microphone that I have. I'm running a uh, Tentacle Track E on the back, and that's giving me my uh, engine sounds. And then if you switch over to the Cardo and you use just the Cardo on its own, it sounds like this. But you add some mic, or sorry, you add the uh, engine sound to the background and mix in the Cardo. Hopefully, it actually sounds pretty good. And hopefully, we get. Um, when we do the group rides together with Haman and Ed and whoever else wants to tag along, we can uh, record our group conversation. That's the whole goal of getting this card out. Well, Haman actually has the exact same unit. He has the pack dock edge, just as I. Both got them on sale, which is nice. The other thing we're gonna test out today is um, if this thing connects to the uh, to the X4 easily. Nice little spot. So we're here with Haman and we're gonna try the uh, the grouping. 
and see how easy this is. So this is the first time we're both doing it. So you want to hit the uh, top button there and yep. hold it. I wonder if I Grouping do initiated. Grouping succeeded. Maybe I got it as well. There you yeah. go. All right. Hey, I hear you. Well, I hear you really loud and clear too. Yeah, I hear you too. Well, that's how easy it is. There you go. So that's pretty good. So now what I'm going to do is I actually want to hit the record. Oh, okay. So now we're recording. Talk? Cool. Yeah. Hello, hello. Testing one, two, three. Testing one, two, three. I don't know if you guys can see this. There you go. Testing one, two, three. Testing so one, that, two, three. So that's Hammond's voice there, and it's picking up my voice as well. That's pretty cool. All right. Well, let's go ride then. Cool. Let's do it. All right. That was easy. That was easy. All right. I guess right. we can ride up the King and then head head over King Road to 400 then, yeah? Yeah. Lead All the right. way. Hey, did you, one thing I noticed about the, uh, the Cardo, have you been able to get the, uh, voice controls and stuff to work? Yeah. But yeah? I, I don't use, I don't, well, through Siri, not, not Cardo. Okay. Right, have so you I tried it? Hey, Cardo. Yeah. Well, I've tried, yeah. So you can say, hey, Siri, and it'll tell you, in uh, do whatever Siri normally does, right? Through voice command? Yeah. Yeah. Because uh, I was having a hard time with the, so I wanted to test out the, um, like the Hey Cardo stuff. Yeah. And um, yeah, I, there's a setting in the uh, in the menu. Yeah. And if you uh, you have to turn the mic sensitivity to high, and then it worked way better. Because I was I was having like 50 percent like hit rate, and then it went to yeah. like 95 percent when uh, I switched that setting. Like it made such a fucking difference. And that's in the app, obviously. Okay. Yeah, it's in the yeah, it's in the app. So if you ever wanted to like do like music on, music off kind of stuff? Yeah. I mean, you can do it with Siri too, right? Holy smoke, I gotta say though that like the voice through like crystal clear, like I can hear you much better than I did uh, on the 4Com and, and the, the Freecom that I had earlier. Yeah. The same with the Pack Talk Gold. Like there's, uh, I mean, obviously there's is kind of interesting yeah well i mean i had the the 20s before and you had what was it that you had i had the cardo freecom yeah and we had a we had a connect uh we were just calling each other on them because we couldn't figure out a way to connect Sir, uh cena and uh <laughs> and yeah, the right. <laughs> fucking horrible so but yeah, yeah no this bad. is way way louder like yeah the the 20s was hey look at hey, tripod yeah. Hey, hard. there's a tripod. That's weird. I know. Are well, you need a tripod? Did you come by here already? I know. It does look like my old tripod, doesn't it? I know. I was like, what? Oh, look at this. <laughs> um, yeah. what the hell was I saying? I was talking about uh, the old, uh, the old. Oh, right. Tried, yeah, the old right? system. How we yeah, the old system connect. was terrible. Yeah, uh, it was so so. And bad. then we just gave up and wanted to just, like calling each other. Yeah. So this is uh, way, way easier now, obviously. Yeah. But you know what I'm wondering? I'm wondering if um, now that we kind of got this figured out, when uh, Ed, whenever next time we ride with Ed, with his Cena, if we can kind of figure out how to uh, get him connected to it. Oh, or just yeah, tell him to sure. buy one of these things. Yeah. Hey, Ed, if you're watching this video, buy a fucking Pack Talk Edge. Buy a Pack Talk Edge. That's it. <laughs> All right, now we're going to get to hear what this sounds like at its speed. Uh oh, can you hear me? Yeah, can you? Uh, yeah, yeah, I hear you. And you know what? I hear you fairly clearly, too. What's that? I hear you pretty clearly. Yeah, I mean, the wind, the wind breaks it up a little bit. Yeah. But all in all, it's actually pretty good. Way better than before. 
Yeah. Remember last year we'd be on the highway and I'd be talking and you'd be like, what? Yeah. What? Yeah. I can't hear you. I can't hear you. What? <laughs> yeah, for sure. It was terrible. That was pretty bad. I want to see if this, uh, if this can uh, share music and we can talk at the same time. So let's, let's see. Let's see if I can turn music on with this a voice command. All right. All right. Hey, Cardo, music on. No, no music. Why? No. All right. Oh, you know why? It's because we we're we're recording. So so when you're uh. recording. When you're recording phone calls, music, everything gets cut off. You can't, um, nothing else works other than the recording. Are you visor down right now? Visor, yeah, it's down. Visor is up right now? Uh, it is now. Can you hear me so? Yeah. I'll put mine up. Can you hear me? Yeah, totally, perfectly fine. Yeah, me too. It's kind of crazy that Cardo's been able to figure out a way to like eliminate the wind sound completely. You know what I mean? Like, uh, for I, sure. It's uh, that's pretty cool tech, to be honest. How it could actually filter out and use like this cancellation like that? It's pretty wild, for sure. Yeah. You'd have to be, you'd have to play around with your levels quite significantly in order to do that across the board and account for noise, uh, noise reduction like the way they have, right? I just I just don't get how they've managed to pull that off. Like there's yeah. all kinds of stuff that has like noise cancellation on it, but nothing like yeah. this. Like this is like next level. Sure. And if it if it and if it records like like we haven't dropped out like I I've heard everything pretty much that you said. When yeah. I was testing it out earlier on at the different setting, like the recording would not catch the, the mic over time. So I'm very curious, like, does yeah. the re is the recording going to be exactly what we're hearing? Like, that's what I'm curious about. I have to say I'm pretty happy with, uh, with the sound of the voice. Yeah, so am I. I think we're on the, uh, the next exit. All right, okay. so I'm going to get Hammond to go on the one kilometer hop. Sorry. <laughs> so I'm gonna get, I, dude. It'll, I don't think I'll ever be able to fix that. It might, it might <laughs> never happen. All right. So, Hamid is gonna go exactly one kilometer away, and we're going to see how the audio sounds from a longer distance. All right, buddy. Off you go. Go. Cool. See you in a bit. What up on the? So you're one kilometer now? Nope. I'm okay. One kilometer right now. You're already starting to break up. Oh. All right. So Hammond is at one kilometer exactly right now, and uh, he's going to take off and uh, go to 1.6 kilometers. Uh, right now he's a bit staticky, but uh, go ahead, Hammond. Hammond. <laughs> So the whole Hammond Hammond thing. So I've been calling Hammond or Hammond. Sorry, see, I'm doing it again. Been calling Hammond Hammond for the longest time. Last year, when I did the video on the pickaxe loop, he reminded me or told me that I've been mispronouncing his name for years, and I cannot, for the life of me, get it right. His name is Hammond, not Hammond. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so how far do you want me to go? 1.6. And then, and then when you get to 1.6, try talking to me. If you can't hear me, just come back. Copy that. Alright, come back. So 1.6 is, uh, definitely a stretch. I mean, there's a lot of, uh, trees and whatnot around, so who knows, uh, if that would be better on the highway. We'll try it again later. Um, and see if, um, see if it's any better out in the open. By the way, the, uh, foreign rider gear underwear, foreign rider, uh, underwear that I've been wearing is, uh, 
making me boil right now. <laughs> oh, I forgot you're listening. I'm I'm talking to the audience. <laughs> you swimming down there? Oh my lord, dude! Now I'm wearing um a new bass layer by uh, Foreign Rider. It's a company uh, based in Toronto, but he's opening up shops all over the U.S. and I think other places too. Super nice guy. I actually ended up selling him. Uh, I sold him a bike. And uh nicest fucking guy in the world. And uh, yeah, he'll hook me up with a whole bunch of gear. So I'm trying out his uh base layer right now. Oh. Yeah. Is that uh that jacket his too? Yeah, yeah. Yeah. There little puffy jacket, the underlayer. Yeah. It's all yeah, it's good shit. Good shit. But right now with this helmet on, it's fucking hot. Alright, signing off. Big pothole. Tip. Not there. <laughs> <laughs>
Um, I can't wait to try that as well. So good job, Cardo. You made a winner here. <laughs>